Today we are going to demonstrate how to put on and remove a thoracolumbosacral orthosis or most commonly referred to as a TLSO. Before we begin our demonstration there are a couple things to take note of. First identify the front and back halves of the TLSO as well as the top of the orthosis there should be identifying marks such as top front or simply an arrow pointing to the top. Also notice the waist indentation which will correspond to the soft space between the ribs and the hips. When applying a TLSO to a patient with bowel precautions, you have to use precaution. Some of that is you have to roll the shoulders and the pelvis in the same plane. The suggestion for doing that is to lock elbows with their opposite arm from the side you're standing on and to have them raise their knees and tilt. So I would do it like so. I would lock elbows and then I would tilt their shoulders and their pelvis in the same plane and then I would heel to that soft spot between the ribs and the pelvis and then put your corresponding indentation on the posterior section between there and then I would lock elbows again when you roll them back roll them back and that's how you lock elbows with somebody with spinal precautions. After you have log rolled the patient and they're on their back, you want to make sure that the indentation is in that soft spot between the ribs and the pelvis. Additionally, you want to make sure that the brace is level. You don't want one side higher than the other. You want both sides level. After you do that, you can apply the anterior section. When you do that, I like to start, a suggestion is to start with the middle strap on both sides. And then it doesn't matter the order if you do top or bottom as much. After you do that and you feel, you'll feel that the first straps that you put on are a little loose. There's a little play there. So you can come back to those and tighten those down. 